Okay, here we go. Here's the email I got on November 3rd. Your channel is no longer eligible to monetize. Learn how to reapply. And then it goes on to say, during a recent review, our team policy specialist carefully looked over the videos you uploaded to your channel and found they are not in line with our YouTube partner policy. Uh, your channel is not eligible to monetize. So what that means is I don't get paid. Big deal. But I don't know how to say this uh, politely, but they're still making money off my videos. So they're taking my cut along with theirs, which it seems a little greedy to me. The uh, partner program policies uh, go on like this. Uh, let's see, community guidelines. Here we go. Uh, flagging a feature. Okay, here's what you can't do. I don't have nudity. Harmful, dangerous content. I don't have that. Hateful content. I don't have violent or graphic content. I don't have. I don't cyber bully anybody. I don't do spam. I don't know what metadata is, so I don't do that. I don't threaten anybody. Copyright. The only thing I can think of is maybe my intro music, but that's a guess because you'll find out later they never tell me what I did wrong. Uh, I don't violate anybody's privacy. I don't impersonate anybody. Child safety, nothing there. And then there's additional policies, which I don't know what the hell they are. Uh, get rid of that. And then we go here. Uh, you violate these policies. You too may take the following actions to save a lad. So they did that. Um, was this helpful? No. And didn't tell me shit. So then... Let's go here to monetization page. Okay, here's why your channel wasn't approved for monetization. Most cases, you can't upload somebody else's content. I don't upload anybody else's content. I may steal other scam baiters' ideas, and I hope mine are good enough that they steal mine. I don't understand what they're talking about. Audiovisual works like television shows I don't do. Sound recordings and musical compositions. Again, that could be my intro music, but I'm only guessing. Visual and written works. I, I don't do that with paintings or posters, no. Dramatic works, plays, and musicals. I've never done a musical. Video games and computer software I don't do. So this is what they're saying, why I wasn't approved. And... The only thing I can think of is the music, but they don't tell me. Uh, we'll no longer be able to earn money from YouTube, including revenue from advertising. Okay, so I can't get any revenue from advertising, which, believe me, it's not that much. It's not going to break me. Okay, so I can't have cards and end screens. That's where uh, I put the playlist up or other videos to look at. I got to review the rules. I did that, and I still don't know why I did it wrong. Avoid up uploading content that belongs to somebody else. And don't pay to increase view counts. Well, if I did that, I'd have a lot more than what I got. So I didn't do that. Take your time and make sure everything looks good. You can reapply anytime after December 3rd. I have no clue what the hell I did wrong here. Okay, then it says if I want to re-enter the program... I start by going to monetization page, which I did. YouTube policies I read. Community guidelines I read. The next step is to edit or delete any videos that violate our policies. Since I don't know what policy I violated, how am I going to edit it or how am I going to delete it? I mean, I go back and edit it if I had to, but I don't know what the hell to edit. Uh, in 30 days, I'll see the option, and then it takes several weeks to get reapproved if they decide to approve me and then of course as mentioned in the partnership program terms the terms of service continues to apply to your use of youtube services even though your partnership terms are terminated which means i can't talk, ask anybody what i did wrong uh i don't know what to do here these people are driving me nuts for no reason and if they just tell me what I did, I'd fix it. And there's no way to get a hold of these guys. There is absolutely no way to get a hold of YouTube. Okay, this is what it means for my channel.
I can still upload videos, edit or delete videos, and communicate with your audience, which is what I'm doing now. What I cannot do is monetize new or existing videos, receive AdSense payments for past YouTube revenue, earn revenue from YouTube premium channel memberships or Super Chat, and I cannot contact YouTube creator support team. So I can't ask anybody what I did wrong. I can't call the support team, whoever the hell they are. I don't know how to get a hold of them anyway. So down the bottom here, 30 days, I'll see a thing I can reapply. Okay, here's my uh, status and features. I have zero copyright strikes, zero community guideline strike, but my monetization is ineligible because I don't know why. Uh, everything else looks all right there. I don't, uh, I, I, I have no strikes, so I don't know what I did wrong, and they won't tell me. Also, somebody left a comment that it could have been because occasionally I've been known to drop an F-bomb here or there. And in the additional policies, it's got uh, some language is not appropriate for younger audiences. Uh, use of sexually explicit language or excessive profanity in your video or associated metadata. Again, I don't know what the hell that is. May lead to the age restriction of your video. So if it's because I drop an F-bomb here or there, and that bothers them, let them put the age restriction on it. I mean, that's what they're supposed to do. They do it doesn't say they can just cancel your monetization. Okay, I had a G-man look at some of my old videos, some new videos, and see if they're still advertising, and they're still advertising. So what they're doing is they're cutting me out, and they're making all the money now. I silenced the videos. Because you're going to see here, there's one coming up, which has my intro. I silenced them because the intro music is there, but I didn't want to get in trouble for it. So I silenced this part, but there it is. There's my opening with the music. You just got to take my word for it. And they're still advertising, putting their stuff up, making their money, and I can hold my hand on my ass. And then I went and looked at a couple. And sure enough, there's more ads, more ads. They're advertising all over the place. And uh, there's uh, my opening again. And believe me, the music's there. I just didn't put it up here because I want to get in trouble again. If that's why I got in trouble. Like I said, we don't know why I got in trouble. They won't tell me. It's a big secret. I mean, these guys are like the scammers. They make up shit, and then you just have to go along with it. Can't do anything about it. So, uh, thanks for watching, thanks for listening to me complain, and uh, be assured I'll still be putting videos up. I'm going to put a link down below of another video I did where they took one of my videos down, I appealed it, and they put it back up. When I was going to get the URL for uh, this one, where they, where they took one of my other videos down and I was complaining, I remembered I had the URL on there of the guy that was faking me to clone my channel. So I looked and he's still there. Now this is an exact duplicate of my channel. Everything's the same except for he's got songs on there. But uh, you look and that's all my stuff. That's me. That's what I got. And uh, you go back up and you look. He's got my uh, playlists that I can't put on the end of mine anymore. Uh, on his channel, on this channel, whatever the hell channel it is. There they are. That's my avatar over here. That's my. I can get to my stuff from his channel, but if I delete his channel, it deletes mine. So there's no way for me to get rid of them on my own, and I know that everybody complained when I first posted this thing. I know a lot of people uh contacted youtube because you can contact them on this and uh, they never did nothing about it it could be this guy they're talking about and not even me they he's got songs from drake and these other people on there that i know are copyrighted maybe that's who they're talking about maybe it's not even me so maybe i didn't do anything wrong i don't know here there's no way for me to appeal so I, i'm just gonna have to accept the fact that they're taking all the money. Thanks again, and thanks for your support. We'll be seeing you.